Hasn't lit yet, has it? Huh? Hasn't lit yet, has it? Do you smell gas at all? Well, obviously there's gas from that, that's, so I'm not smelling gas. That's true. Gas it is true. I'm just not smelling any gas and I'm trying to go both ways. I think these might be clogged. Yeah. I don't know. Shall we remove them? No. Okay. That'd be something they'd need to do, because I'm not yeah. sure how they are. It could be rusty or something. That's why you hire experts. Yeah. So I really would like them to get a furnace running, but I can't get it. There's no gas. Gas is supposed to shoot in. And you definitely it's, smell it. Yeah. Because it comes in through here. It comes in through here, and it shoots through here. And then that ignites it, and it burns. just burns all through here. Something's clogged with gas. There's no gas smell at all. There aren't any valves that are. Here's the gas valve right here. Okay. We think in line would be in line, but I've tried it both ways. Closed, open, okay. I guess. Well, have you tried it halfway? Oh, no. Try it halfway. Maybe it's an odd valve. No, it's not. It's, that's off. Oh, okay, I see. So I think that's off. Usually crossways is off. Yeah. And that way is on. Yeah, that makes sense. But I'm not smelling any gas. And gas shouldn't go until it clicks. So this thing is on and it clicks and should l allow gas through. You need to get him another uh, furnace filter. Yeah. There's nothing there. Mm. But it's like this allows the gas to now be fed What's through. What's that? Pressure gauge or temperature gauge? I'm not sure. That's a pressure gauge, I think. The fan part works. Mm -hmm. Might need a little bit of oil, but that's good. We can't get. I can't. No gas is shooting out. Okay. No, that's the water heater. Yeah, that's the water heater running. So at least we do have gas, but. Yeah, if we have gas. It's just a matter of not this gas. What's underneath here? Um, this has to be on. Uh, it's the computer board. Oh, okay. But it has to be on or it won't. Uh, Have we seen it in there? Like, oh there... yeah, I just put this on. Oh okay. I just you know you never know there's a grass nest in there or something. You have to have this depressed or it won't start. Yeah. But the the, the, the status is working. That's Everything's good. working on there. Nothing's unhooked. It has to do with the gas. Something to do with this or this. Isn't isn't igniting? Yeah, and I'm, I'm just activating. Yeah, I don't know if it's not igniting or. What's this switch? Huh? A little that, switch. Yeah, that switch you have to have on. I, I you have to turn it off to reset it. Yep, I will turn it on. Okay. There's no gas. There's no gas doing it. Yeah. And this thing is the igniter right down there. That's the igniter, and it's not igniting anything. So yeah, turning that switch turns it on. Hmm. That's what I've been trying. And I try it, even these are gas now. No. Getting gas, so I'm thinking it might be clogged or that ignition part isn't. The wiring isn't turning well, on the solenoid or whatever. Well, it's not that there's not allowing the gas through because it stops the gas. That's what I said, not turning on the solenoid. Yeah. Yeah. So it might be something to do, but that would be like for a furnace technician. Right, right. Would you like a safety light? We have a safety light we can like oh, take, take a light closer or whatever. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, uh, so should I go turn it on or anything? Or? Yeah, go ahead and turn it up. Uh, Sounds good. So it turns on? Yeah. Cool. Thank you. <laughs> It's a, they, they call it a smart valve, and so you don't have a control board to operate anything. It's mm. all through there. This is a control board, but it's a fan timer control board, so oh. that doesn't. It's totally different. Are they pretty? Inter are they pretty interchangeable, or do they have a lot of a lot of different ones that are uh, hard to track down? There's about forty different. 
Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Gas valves that are available. Because that wasn't heating up or sparking or whatever it does. Yeah, it's, it heats up, yep. Uh, it's like a glow plug. That's a shame. Oh well. Thank you very much for all the diagnostics and oh, all, oh, all the help. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I mean, this is just some things you gotta. Well, that's one of the issues. The pros with, I mean, well, that's one of the issues with embedded technology. What we did to this furnace last time, but it's been probably four or five years since we've been here last. Yeah. You hear that? Well, oh, I just shut off. Did it? Yeah, you just shut it off again. We're here in a furnace going, which is we've been waiting for like a what two weeks now for this darn thing to get fixed. Ever since I got here, yeah. It, it turns out it's like almost every single part that's bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We're just gonna wait and let the worker have plenty of time in there, and he'll come up and tell us what's that. Has a distinct smell of cat piss. Do you smell that? Yeah. I, I'm stuffed up, so I can't. Uh, we have to pressure wash those ducts. Oh god. Hey Bill, good bad news. It works, but the ducts make it smell like cat piss. It works though. But it smells like cat piss. Hey, we'll get some air freshener if it works. Okay. Yes! <laughs> Finally. Come in. Enjoy. Uh, put out your smoke and come in. Yes, we have heat. I guess it was the wiring harness. It replaced a lot of parts. It works? Yes! Oh, yes! You can smell the cat piss, can't you? Hey, I'm, we'll get some air fresh. Well, evi oh, evidently, yes! evidently, the person that has this house had a lot of cats or something like Thanks, that. Man. Thank you. The, uh, the gas valve, the gas valve. Not up here. It's odd. Hmm. And it is up here, though. Nice. Awesome. Let's see, just heating up this room. I doubt it would do much of an impact on this room, but. Oh, it's definitely coming up, but very light amount. I'm just gonna close that because there's no reason to waste the heat in this room. Is that shut? Shut. She's rusting your eyes. <laughs> you do too. Um, we should actually do that and knock all that crap loose. Maybe not when it's running. Yeah. Uh, but, but, um, but they do shut. Wait, we're going to be removing all those and fully restoring them, though. Well, I like the fact that they shut, because then we yeah. can shut off whatever we don't want. I shut off the library room. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, so. Yeah, and then we'll have to clean out the, the one for the bathroom and that one bedroom. Yeah. Is a combo one. It's clogged up. Yeah. Um, but it doesn't smell like cat piss anymore. No. Just let no, it run a little bit. I never really caught a whiff of that. I got it pretty bad. Okay. You weren't up here whenever it first started, though. Yeah. So. The furnace is working. And what was it? The uh, the furnace guys. It was the brand new gas valve that was, was faulty. put in that was defective from the factory. And and the, and the previous fat gas valve, the old one was bad too. And the old one was bad, needed to be replaced. So yeah. they replaced the gas valve, and it didn't work. And so now it was a mystery. Why doesn't it work? Why doesn't it work? They tried everything they could think of. Turns out it was a defective. Brand new gas pump. Look at that. You can see the flames. Oh yeah, look at that. That's some good heat. Very 
very nice. So that's like 600 bucks spent. Um, but you know what? We have so much other stuff to deal with that. Right, I think the bill is going to be about 600 bucks. That's what they quoted me. Yeah. But if, if I'd have had to pay per visit, that would have been all a lot the more. other parts, because they put more parts in this than just the gas valve. Yeah, they, they put, put a new brand new circuit board in, gas valve. I don't think they put a new wiring harness in. No, it? because he, yeah. But I, uh, I thought there was one other piece they put in, but I'm not sure. The but pressure it, sensor? Maybe, but I was assured that the quoted price was yeah. in. So. Well, guys, that's pretty much it because it's been like two weeks, a week and a half that we've been trying to get this darn thing working and we just had to call in the experts and even they were stumped. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We're going to enjoy the heat and thank you very much for watching. See ya. Do you feel like dancing? Do you feel like dancing? Do you feel like doing a little jig? This was the coldest room in the house because I always had the door closed. Vince over there. Right there, okay. Nice. <laughs> I'm gonna leave the door open. And now the now the hallway is the coldest room in the house. Yeah, that bedroom. Well, hey, how about the bedroom? Do we try that? Yeah, it works. I shut off the the vent. Oh, okay.